Yeah, so with Kraft being at the table with the original steering committee, they were seeing an increasing demand for people looking for donations in, uh, in specifically in COVID from their plant. So when they came to the table with us, they agreed that all of the food that they had that would be available for donation would come specifically to our location in Colborne. And then anybody that reached out to Kraft looking for donations would automatically be forwarded to us to assist. And it was a small thing for us to do to be able to get access to that uh, large amount of food that they had available. So it was a great partnership when we first started. If our warehouse supplies got low at any point in time, it was a simple phone call. And within a couple of days, there would be another tractor to trailer load being backed up to our door and we'd unload it and it didn't take long to fill our little warehouse down there and it was through the that support from craft that got us off the ground initially and allowed us to do what we do in the community now.